This is Griffin with Wayson Furniture. Today we're going to be building the Your Zone storage bookcase. This is our white finish and it can be found on walmart.com. Uh, before we start, you want to check that you have all your pieces, none of them have any damage while shipping, and that you have all your hardware. Uh, if you have any problems, you can call the number on the front of your manual and we'll get you taken care of. Uh, if there are no problems, we can be ready to start. For step one, you're going to want to take 12 wood dowel pieces, your two A panels, and your B panel. Start by inserting the wood dowels into the two inner pre-drilled holes, not these outer two screw holes. You want to leave about 3 eighths of an inch sticking out of the panel, and if it doesn't slide in all the way, you can gently hammer it in a little. For step two, you're going to want to have 12 wood dowel pieces, your F panel, and your E panel. Start by inserting the wood dowels into these uh, middle two holes for the wood dowel pieces. And then on these longer sides, there will be three larger wood dowel holes. Okay, and then come over to your E panel. And insert them into the two middle wood dowel pre-drilled holes. For step three, you're gonna to wanna to have your F panel, your B panel, and three of these longer one screws. Uh, set up your B panel so that the side with these uh, pre-drilled holes is down. Slide the wood dowel pieces in and then screw it in to these three uh, pre-drilled holes on the bottom. For step four, you're going to want to keep this structure that we just built and grab your C panel. Uh, align your C panel so that this side with a little bit of an indented hole is facing out away from the structure. This will allow the screw head to rest flushly inside. Okay, and then you will want to grab five of these longer screws and screw them into the bottom three holes and then these two um, side holes. Okay, after you've screwed in those five screws, you'll want to take five of these cover stickers and place them over the nail or the screw. For step five, you're going to want to grab your two A panels, four screws, and four cover stickers. Attach your A panels with the finished side facing up. Okay, and then screw them in into these four holes. Next, you'll want to uh, cover these screw heads with the cover stickers. For step six, you're going to want to have two screws and two cover stickers, and then your E panel. Align your E panel so that the curved piece is facing towards uh, these two A panels. Okay, and 
and then you want to screw it in with these two holes here and here. Then you want to take your two cover stickers and cover up the screw heads. Okay, for step seven, you're going to want to take your D panel, 11 screws, and 11 cover stickers. Uh, you want to align this D panel so that the holes with a little bit of an indention are facing out away. Another way is to know this is that there are more holes on this side, and you want these facing towards the wood dowels. Okay, then align all your pieces. and then screw it in. Once you've screwed in all 11 screws, you can begin to add the cover papers, or cover stickers.